Hi, this is Michael William Denny of ThunderShamanism.com and welcome to the second installment of the Easy Vedic Astrology uh, teaching series. So this is Easy Vedic Astrology Volume 2 and in this one we're going to talk about spiritual liberation and past life influences. So uh, if you haven't already, you have to go back and watch the first one. That first 90 minute video has some extremely important information uh, that you're going to need to know in order to be able to know what we're talking about in this. So just, you know, a recap here. Easy Vedic Astrology is about giving you the practical information that you need to know in order to make your life better. Astrology is a huge science. Just to give you an example, you know, this, this is one of the first books that I started reading. It's an introduction to Vedic astrology. It's uh, 500 pages long. You know, what can I use? What can I practically take from this science in order to make my life better? That's really what this is all about. And so that's what I want to give to you. But I'm telling you that what I'm going to give you here is practical stuff that you can use right now today to make your life better. So that's what we're going to focus on. So this one, we're going to focus on your spiritual liberation and on past life influences. So um, there are four DVDs. The first one is the introduction, which you have to watch first in order to understand what I'm saying here. This second one is we're going to be looking at what's called the chosen deity or the chosen planet, which is the planet that has chosen to help you achieve spiritual liberation in this life. In the next DVD, we're going to be talking about the planet of destiny, which is the planet that is guiding you on your path in this life, which you have a destiny to fulfill, which will, you know, the, the reason for your actions in this life, which will bring you luck, which will bring you um, fulfillment on uh, all kinds of levels. That is in the next DVD. And then the one after that, the fourth one, we're going to be talking about the planet that wants to physically empower you to give you things like money, cars, and those kinds of things.